welcome to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we're giving you an exclusive first look at the 2025 Volkswagen ID.7, VW's electric flagship. Volkswagen's ID series has been making waves in the electric vehicle market, and the ID.7 is the sixth global model to join the lineup. Although it's already gaining popularity in Europe and China, this electric powerhouse is set to make its mark in the United States as VW aims to expand its electric presence. With the sedan market far from extinct, we're excited to see the ID.7 step up as a worthy challenger to Tesla's supremacy. Boasting a competitive range to rival the Tesla Model 3, the ID.7 offers a spacious, feature-rich interior that is sure to impress. And with a potent electric motor under the hood, you can expect swift acceleration to match its stylish design. The ID.7 is truly poised to build on the success of the ID.4 in the American market. After its global debut in April 2023, the Volkswagen ID.7 is set to hit North American shores in 2024 as a 2025 model, with Europe and China getting their hands on this exceptional EV first in the fall of 2023. As we dive deeper into the 2025 Volkswagen ID.7, let's talk about its pricing strategy. In a market that's now heavily skewed towards SUVs, it's a bold move to introduce a new sedan. Therefore, getting the pricing right is crucial. The entry-level RWD model, sporting the smallest battery, is expected to have a base price starting at around $45,000 MSRP. Categorizing the ID.7 isn't an easy task, as its presumed price tag places it in competition with the Tesla Model 3. However, when it comes to size, the ID.7 is much closer to the significantly pricier Model S. Despite these differences, we still believe the Model 3 to be the most relevant rival if the $45,000 estimate proves accurate. The European Pro S variant is likely to make its way across the Atlantic as well, potentially costing between $50,000 and $55,000. While VW hasn't explicitly mentioned a dual-motor, all-wheel drive model, we anticipate that such a configuration will also be available in the US market. With these price points, the ID.7 will be positioned to go head-to-head -head with the likes of the BMW i4, making for an exciting battle in the EV market. Moving on to the design of the Volkswagen ID.7, this stylish sedan takes inspiration from the ID. Aero concept car, while adding its own unique flair. One of the most eye-catching exterior features is the fastback design, where the sleek roofline flows seamlessly into the rear end. The back of the car is defined by horizontal lines and a striking LED light strip that curves into the LED taillight cluster. As we move to the side, a distinctive feature line runs beneath the windows and extends to the sculpted hood, culminating in LED matrix headlights. The DRLs are represented by a slim LED strip that also includes the turn signals. With its steeply raked windshield and nearly enclosed front end, aerodynamics take center stage. The design incorporates lower side air curtains and a central air intake, as well as flared sills and a rear diffuser to optimize airflow. The ID.7 will ride on wheels up to 20 inches in diameter, all designed with aerodynamics in mind, as evidenced by the low drag coefficient of just 0.23. Additional exterior features include a panoramic sunroof with electric chroming technology that can be switched between transparent and opaque settings, all controlled by voice commands. While we don't have information on the available color options, we do know that the roof pillars and roof will come in contrasting high-gloss black, complemented by aluminum look strips in the roof frame, standard across all models. 
The 2025 Volkswagen ID 7 foot south dimensions place it closer to larger C-segment vehicles, measuring 195.3 inches in length and featuring a 116.8 inch wheelbase. The sedan is 73.3 inches wide, excluding mirrors, and stands 60.6 inches tall. Although the curb weight hasn't been disclosed, it's reasonable to expect a weight of over 4,000 pounds due to the battery packs and other onboard technology. Higher spec models with additional features may tip the scales even further. So, what can we expect from the ID7 in terms of performance and drivetrain options? While Europe is confirmed to receive two versions, the specifics of what the US market will see are still uncertain. Volkswagen has shared that both the Pro and Pro S models, trims familiar from the ID4, will feature a newly developed 282 horsepower permanent magnet synchronous motor a two-stage one-speed gearbox, and an inverter. This setup promises enhanced power, efficiency, and durability thanks to the low-friction components in the gearbox. As for battery options, European models will have a choice between an 82 kWh battery with 77 kWh, usable for the base model, and a 91 kilowatt hour battery with 86 kilowatt hours usable for the Pro S. Unfortunately, only the smaller battery is expected to be available in the US. Other performance details remain under wraps, so we don't yet know the 0 to 60 miles per hour times for the ID7. However, if a dual motor configuration is offered, a 6 second sprint might be achievable. The standard models will be rear-wheel drive, as the motor is mounted on the rear axle. We'll keep you updated as more official specs are released. Volkswagen claims that the ID7S standard suspension, enhanced adaptive damping, and updated driving dynamics manager strike the perfect balance between comfort and agility. The rear axle features specially tuned, high damping elastokinematic mounts, which, in combination with a low center of gravity, should provide exceptional handling. The aerodynamic design of the ID7, featuring a drag coefficient of just 0.23, works in harmony with the high efficiency drivetrain to maximize range. Built on the MEB platform with 400 volt architecture, the base 82 kilowatt hour battery supports charging rates of up to 170 kilowatts. When connected to a direct current fast charger, you can expect to recharge from 5 to 80% in around 40 minutes, potentially delivering an EPA rated range of over 300 miles, with a WLTP range of 382 miles. Volkswagen estimates a maximum range of 435 miles for the ID7, though this is based on the more optimistic European WLTP cycle. To align with EPA expectations, we can anticipate a range of around 360 to 380 miles. The larger battery pack found in the Pro S model can charge at a 200 kilowatts capacity reducing charge times and extending range. However, this option is currently reserved for the European market. Even if the ID7 doesn't quite achieve a 300-mile range, coming close to this milestone would be impressive, considering its competitive starting price and comparison to rivals like the base BMW i4. With the 82 kWh battery, this should be feasible, as the less aerodynamic ID4 SUV already boasts a range of 275 miles on a single charge. The interior of the Volkswagen ID7 showcases a brand new design, emphasizing high quality and spaciousness. As VW points out, the long wheelbase ensures ample legroom for all passengers. While the 18.8 cubic feet of cargo space may not rival many SUVs, it's quite generous for a sedan. 
The cabin features a soft padded dashboard with an optional ambient lighting and contrast stitching for a more premium feel. Adding optional piping further enhances the luxurious atmosphere, while the overall design highlights the width and roominess of the sedan's interior. The cockpit setup ditches conventional instruments in favor of a small digital panel and an augmented reality head-up, display as standard. This HUD helps keep the driver's eyes on the road by displaying important information like speed and driver assists. Additional tech includes a 15-inch infotainment display with a new menu structure, housing settings for cabin and seating climate control. VW offers a 700W premium Harman Kardon sound system with 14 speakers and a subwoofer. Automatic parking is also standard, enabling autonomous parking from over 54 feet away, whether you're inside or outside the vehicle. European models come with travel assist as standard, but it's unclear whether this feature will be available in US models. VW's new front seat design in the ID7 deserves special attention. These seats offer optional adaptive climatronic massage and, with temperature and moisture sensors, automatically adjust to keep passengers comfortable with independent settings for the seat and backrest. Depending on the trim, the seats also provide up to 14 ways of power adjustment. A notable feature of the ID7 is the Climate Control System's active vent control. Smart air vents distribute air throughout the cabin efficiently without blowing it directly into passengers' faces. This system can even be activated as you approach the car with the key. In conclusion, the 2025 Volkswagen ID7 promises to be an exciting addition to the electric vehicle market. With its sleek design, impressive range, and cutting-edge technology, it's set to be a strong contender against established rivals. As we eagerly await its official release, we'll continue to keep you updated on the latest news and developments surrounding this innovative electric sedan. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to stay informed on all things automotive. See you in the next video.